So in this video, you'll learn how to add an analog clock to the lock screen of your Samsung Galaxy S25. So the first step is to access the lock screen editor, and we can do this in two ways. One of them is by opening the settings app, then looking for lock screen and AOD and selecting it. Then from here, look for edit lock screen and tap on it, and this will direct you to the lock screen editor. Alternatively, you can always just go to the lock screen directly, and then just long press on it to enter editing mode. If you have a pin, password, or pattern, you will be prompted to enter it in before you can start editing. Once you've done that, you should then be brought to the lock screen editor. And in order for you to add your analog clock, start by tapping on the clock widget on your screen. Then from here, you want to tap on style. And under style, you want to swipe through the different options until you find the analog clock. So you have this one here that has numbers. And then from here, you can choose how you want it to be by customizing the font and color. So you can change the color to suit your own preferences, or you can just having it match with the background, completely up to you. You can also choose to change the size of the widget. So you can choose to make it larger so that it's covering the whole screen, or you can make it smaller so it's just a small clock. You can also move it around, so just long press on it to drag it wherever it is you want on your screen. Obviously, you can only keep it to the top of your screen, so just choose wisely. And then, once you've finished with all your customizations, you want to tap on Done to save and apply the changes. Once you've finished, you should see your analog clock has been added to the home screen of your Galaxy S, sorry, to the lock screen of your Galaxy S25. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.